Hey guys, you're watching this one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to the episode of Let's Build a Medieval City. End of last episode, we quickly built these miniature houses, these sort of slum houses, only one story tall. We still need to do the inside of them, uh, but because they're only one story and literally like eight blocks inside, they're not exactly hard to do, are they? I mean, a bed, crafting table, furnace, ta da. Uh, so, yeah, I really, though, like the view from over here you know how you can just see the church you can just see the roofs of the building it's that perfect you guys are excluded from the city look do you know what i mean like there's a mountain in the way or a hill in the way so you can't see it on the floor and if they climb to the top oh they can they can just see over it oh how they would wish to be involved with all the city events and the festivals and all of the money and gold they get but nope they're stuck here However, I have just neatened up the uh, Smuggler's Cove a little bit, or the tunnel to it, I should say. So I uh, swapped it all out for cobblestone to give it sort of that mined out look. And then, oh, I missed a few here. And then it goes all the way down now with uh, with torches. So it's, it's all neat now. There's no floating bridge or nothing through space. <laughs> anyway, let's get out of here. And today, I'd be... Ooh, what a lovely little island. Look at that tropical little island. That's awesome. With the beaches there. I've never seen that before. I've never really looked over that way. After 59 episodes, I've never looked that way. <laughs> today, though, I'd really like to neaten this up. I want to get the floor down in here. I want to get a fence. A, a broken fence goes around the side here. I don't want no wall or nothing like that. But just, I think, a wooden fence would do... Maybe even a cobblestone wall, but like really broken up in spots. And then I'd like to do things like in this space here, a real simple thing to do, but I think we'll just add a little bit of detail, is they don't have stables, okay? They're, they're too poor to have like a stable going on here, but they can, that's too high. Um, but they can have like a, a basic open style one, which again, nicely fills up some of these open-ish areas uh, slab so something oops like that like that hmm do I like do I like that now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up by one we'll do it like that one there and then one wrong way around like that Fill those in like this. Mm, I don't like it on this one. I've been doing that a lot, haven't I? I've been putting those fence braces a lot on this series recently. I sort of need to get back out of the habit of that, I think. <laughs> it's nice for this series, but I don't want to go too much. Okay, and then hay. So, like, they can just store, like, a little bit, uh, like, a few animals here. Like that, maybe a cauldron with some water in it there you go they'll be able to tie the horses onto these and at least that way they've got like a little bit is there any other sort of spaces that we can do something like that in not really but boy that does make a huge difference another thing that i want to do is some fires now if we think of like slums or, or homeless areas like nowadays in modern times uh we still have the old barrel with a fire in it do you know what i mean like that old school proper film Esque style sort of fire. Uh, I think I just want like a little ground fire in the middle here. But everything's made of wood. And I don't want to turn fire spread off. So we might have to use uh, like a glowstone or something like that. Because I don't like it when we turn fire spread off. I'd much rather it not be. So we do a little fire in the ground like this. We'll do some stairs. Put a little bit of sort of holes going on like this. Oops. Something like that. Uh, I'm not like a, I can't put buttons down. That block there it just looks like there's something missing. See now it looks like a me it's meant to be like a face. I don't like it when you can see the side of the dirt like that. Ah 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 slab. We put a slab on there. I put a full block underneath it so it doesn't drive you guys crazy. There we go. 
Awesome, much better. And then we'll get some logs. They're not called logs, though. They're just called wood. We'll have this going along here. See, we can definitely... Oh, maybe that's a bit high. Slabs. We can definitely not have a real fire here now because of these benches. Little seat there. There's not really too much places I can actually get the seat. There we go. That's fine, isn't it? And then in the bottom here... Um, I... It's going to end real badly, isn't it? <laughs> it's going to end real badly. Uh, what about... Let's let's be really creative, right? Bit of glowstone for the light. And then... What about like a couple of pieces of glass? Yeah. That's pretty creative to me. I think that looks a little bit like a fire, right? It's a totally safe fire. I actually really like that. We might do that at the blacksmith. Because they've got like a fire. And I think using the glass actually is really cool. Really cool. It's a little fire, communal fire in the middle there, you know, keep some people warm. I think that's pretty good. Let's go now around with a fence. I've already got a cobblestone wall on me. I already had a fence on me too. And I just want to do like a bro oops, a broken up style fence. So something like like this. Maybe we'll go sort of halfway and then change it to a cobblestone wall for a little bit. And then go back to fence. So uh, we'll go to there and then we'll go with a cobblestone wall. Really sort of broken up. In fact, we've got the mossy wall as well. We'll mix that in afterwards. And then we'll go back to a fence here. Like that. Yep. Let's just mix in some mossy cobble here. Just so it pops out a little bit. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, I think I want some hedges in. Like, a, it's a slums area, right? Like, they're meant to be sort of, sort of very, very, very poor. And a lot of people homeless around here. But if you leave it blank, it's re there's really nothing. It's really blank in Minecraft. You know what I mean? There's, there's nothing to sort of dress up with. So I'm going to have to go around with some leaves here. And get like a little fire, another fire in here, can't I? I'm sure I can get a little fire in here. Something like that. I bet this will look quite good at night time as well, you know. Stairs. And like this. Uh, can I do a little curve on that one? Slab. What was it? Orange, wasn't it? Orange. That one. Okay, cool. So another one in there. And then they had the uh, oak slabs. I think that looks so neat. Okay, back to the bushes. So although these bushes... <laughs> we always use bushes in our worlds to make things look sort of more expensive and, and 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 fancier in here we're sort of going with more of a uh, it's overgrown and can't be maintained style look that's what we sort of want to go for so i don't want them i don't want them neat or nothing like that they're just sort of a bit overgrown a bit too tall that works pretty well now the ground around here i want it boggy and marshy like, let's grab some blocks. We're going to want Podzol. We're going to want to have... Well, I mean, under brown, what have we got? Brown wool. Maybe some brown clay in there. These are all modern blocks. I don't want to worry about those. I mean, dirt would be great. But I, I'm not going to change all of this grass to Podzol and stuff. And this grass will end up spreading down to the dirt. And it's, it's just not worth the hassle. <laughs> uh... Oh, maybe a little bit of soul sand in there. Very grubby. I'm going to stay very far away from mycelium. I mean, there's some other browns that we could mix in. The clays that we could mix in if we wanted to. 
In fact, I might go with that one instead of the one that we had because it's a little bit darker. There's a little bit more of a contrast on there. All right, so let's just write down some numbers here. 3, 2, 35, 12. Uh, wrong one. 159, 7. And 88. So if we uh, grab a wand as well. Let's do a test area. Like, I don't know, from there to there. Replace grass with 3, 2. Because we've written them all down here, so I don't need to remember. 35, 12, 159, 7, and 88. Oops, is it the hashtag? Yeah. Oh, that's really nice. Yes. So I need to be a little bit careful around this outside area. Oh, I think the soul sound was a fantastic choice. So I'm just trying to get this, like... Pretty close. I don't want to change the stone up or nothing like that. But just sort of really nearby. Um, do you want to go underneath the plants? I don't mind going underneath the plants in some spots, I suppose. There. Oh, that's really nice. I might even change this outside grass to sand. I that could that could work as well. We'll do that afterwards. Not not to make it like beach, but I think it'll just look neater than than the grass. Uh, there. great thing about this is that it's really really random like I don't have to try and think of it being random or nothing like that uh, there actually going a lot quicker than I thought this was a lot of <laughs> a lot of area to try and cover hmm oh I see you around here there I think I can go pretty crazy with this one I think I can like hit right over there just go underneath the ground because there's a huge mountain there and I don't think oh it pops out one out the other side there we go oh there's pods all got an itchy eyeball okay I think it's gone uh, this one this one I don't mind like I said going underneath a bit of the um, hedges and I think That's like everything, right? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Right. Definitely need to get rid of the grass. The grass now looks weird. And I think sand... I think sand will look better. So if we went like something like... Oops. Something like that. I'm going to try and like cheese it to get all of it. Something like that. Replace grass with sand. Yeah, see the, the yellow of the sand blends in better with the browns. I think they're they're much closer. Or oh, even got a little bit on that. I like it on there as well, I think. I really, really like that. I really and I still like the um hedges. I don't think there's much that we can sort of add to this like a little farming area would have been nice but they're smuggling it all in anyway they shouldn't even be here which is why it's all like this anything else nothing in there i have to put some ferns down on the pods all no it looks too much like a like a tiger biome whatever you call them dead bushes nah I don't like none of those. I mean, some skeletons would be a little cool, but a little too grim, I think. No, I really like the fires, though. So, what we need now is a walkway through. I need to get rid of both these trees, that's for sure. Get out of here, trees. 
and then we need to just carve out like a little path through here fill all of that in set grass so I suppose I don't mind going up a block um I don't know what I want to do here like I think I just fill this part of the water in I sort of like the um get out of here chicken I like this bit of I like how the river sort of comes in here oh this is what this is where we've um dug out the tunnel underneath isn't it that's what the cobblestone is that's the, that's the tunnel See, I like I like this how the river comes in or the ocean comes in from the outside. But then where are we gonna hook up to? Oh, you could probably hook up straight to here, right? Like have a few of these and a few of them and a couple of them. One of them. Oops. One of them, maybe maybe two of them and another one of them and then it goes down here Man, i need to go a few more don't i oh that's the stair <laughs> i need to be in line with like a flat area right i think that should do and then what's what stairs do we do for this then? Or do we not? Do we keep it with the whole pods all and stuff look? And just make it a full block step. So if we go something like this. Because there's no like brown stairs apart from wood. There's nothing sort of brownish. So I think that would work for the staircase ah poop for the staircase down. So one more. Trying to keep it natural. It's hard to do it by hand. Um yes, one. Yeah, that works. So it looks worn. It, it still blends into the train really nicely, but it looks a, a bit, a bit worn. So I'm just trying to get a little bit of a nice curve on there, through the middle here. Is all fine. Help this along a bit. That's just that's dirt. There we go. Awesome. Fence and stuff. Well, I think once we get the trees down here, all the oak trees, that'll be more of a, an opening than an actual path. <clears throat> we might link this back round, you see. So it doesn't look like they made a path for it. We'll just link that round. And then imagine a load of trees on here. And then, oh, a little opening, and you come down. Ugh, the soul sand does slow you down a little bit. Let's just try and miss the soul sand. There we go. Yeah, I like that. This is a bit of an open area here. It's a little bit bigger than I thought. Might put um, an animal pen in there, like um, pigs or, or chickens or something like that. That would be interesting to do. Go on then. Let's, let's give that a go. Get a brown one in there. Fence. Like this. We'll do the classic style pen. I'll split it up in the middle. And we can have uh, spawn chickens. And what do we want? Pigs? I'm thinking pigs because they sort of remind people of like dirtiness 
There you go. There's like three of them. Really, chicken? You're in, in that one, huh? Gate. Oh, no. I th yeah, yeah, yeah. Gate will work. I suppose. And then... Oh, no, not that. And that. And that. Just trying to make it look a little bit interesting. Uh, slab. This one. Okay. Uh, from the top. Alright, so then they've got a little bit of a sort of undercove area as well. I like this. I think I think this is pretty decent now. Let's put one fence going up here. Yeah. Basic little farm. That's actually quite a nice way to sort of start a survival farm as well, I think. Like in a survival world, just doing something like that looks neater than just open pens. Alright, I like this. If you guys enjoyed the episode, then hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. Oh, look at the fires. Oh, yes. We shall see you guys in the next episode. Bye!